What's up everybody, Matt Modai here with Odds Jam, and in this video, I'm just giving you my favorite DFS picks for tonight. Um, when I say DFS, I specifically am talking about prize picks in this video. Um, what I will say is that there is, um, it's a little bit of a lighter slate tonight in terms of the games. Uh, we only have four or five NBA games, not a ton. One of those games includes the Sixers, who's missing four of their five starting lineups. So a lot of weirdness there against the Nets. Um, and then we have some hockey, obviously, because it is a Tuesday during a non-COVID NFL year. There is no Tuesday night football. So leaving us with a little bit of a lighter slate, but that doesn't mean that there aren't good plays to make. So what I'm going to be doing, I have a two entry prize picks play for you guys. Uh, the first leg that I want to play here is this DeMontis Sabonis over five and a half assists. So I like this one a lot. It's showing up on the Odds Jam positive expected value page. Um, look at where all of the other books price it. So if you open up a play, um, like you literally just click into it and you look at all the other markets and what they're pricing it, literally every other book, except for, I guess, you know, FanDuel, or excuse me, DraftKings and Caesars, but it's mostly in the minus 140s, mid minus 140s or minus 150s. We see Pinnacle, minus 149. That's really important. Pinnacle is the sharpest sports book in the world. We see Foxbet at minus 150. Bet Rivers at minus 159. We see DraftKings at minus 140. That's another important one. DraftKings, I don't know if they use their DFS data or what, but DraftKings does a really good job specifically with player props. So I like to use DraftKings along with Pinnacle as a sports book to kind of set the market of sorts. Uh, we have Bet365 at minus 150. We have Caesars at minus 131, so not as favorable. We have FanDuel at minus 148, and we have points bet at minus 145. So all in all, all of these very smart sports books price this at about minus 124 of the no big odds. They give this bet over a 55% chance of hitting, which is kind of cool. Uh, for those of you that aren't familiar with sports betting, um, all odds have an associated win percentage with them, right? So plus 100 equals 50-50, right? 50% chance. Plus 200 is like 33%, stuff like that. Um, and the Novig odds that Ajim calculates, these numbers right here pulled from the sharpest sports books in the world, give this bet a 55% chance of winning. And with prize picks, the cool thing about prize picks in Underdog and Thrive is they have the same implied payout for every single play, no matter what. So if you're doing a two-leg one, you're always gonna double your money, no matter what. If you're doing a five-leg one, you're gonna 20X your money, no matter what. So what I like to do is find player props that all of the actual sports books that are pricing odds for each play individually, find plays that they think are very likely to hit. In this case, 55% chance of this play hitting. So DeMontis Sabonis is going to be, or over five and a half assists, I should say, is going to be my first prize picks play for you today. And my next one is going to be in a hockey game, player points, Victor Olofsson, under 0.5 points. So basically does not accrue a point. Um, the no big odds that Ajim calculates, not quite as favorable on this one, minus 120. But again, look across the board at where the other sports books price it. Again, not as good as the Sabonis one, but still pretty good. Pinnacle, minus 142. Bet Rivers, minus 148. DraftKings, minus 140. FanDuel, uh, points bet, minus 138, minus 140. All in all, giving this one just under a 55% chance of hitting 54.69% chance of hitting for this hockey one, Sabres versus Canadians game. Uh, but this is going to be my second prize picks play today. So if these two hit, you will double your money. Uh, DeMontis Sabonis over five and a half assists and Victor Olofsson under 0.5 points, so it does not record a point. And again, that's going to be it. So if you are tailing this on prize picks, comment and let me know. If you do, good luck to all of us. Hope we all cash together. Other than that, please remember to like the video, subscribe to the IGM YouTube channel. All that good stuff helps helps me out a ton. But that's it. So thanks for watching and have a good one.